get your vitamin J. Welcome back to another J try on haul. Yeah, they're so good. We love them so much. I do have a lot of fun making them though. So today we are trying on some dresses. Spring's coming up. That's fun. I like spring. More bugs, but you know, it's fun. Better weather. So I'm gonna be trying on some dresses. And I'm not typically a dress girl, so we will see how many of these dresses I do like, dislike, what I think of them, and that sort of thing. And of course there will be a behind the scenes video at mygibberygirl.com. So if you wanna see that, go there. <laughs> Slapping my knees. And without further ado, we're gonna get into it. We're gonna show you these dresses. They're pretty cute, they're pretty flowy, they're pretty tight. Some of them are flowy, some of them are tight. Well, like I said. Okay, here we go. This one. It's cool, it's hip, it's pink. I like the pink. I like the pastel pink too. I don't know if I would wear a hot pink dress for me personally. I don't know, but definitely the pastel pink, although it kind of does blend into my skin tone because I'm a pretty pink person. Pretty pink person. The fabric is pretty soft. It's not uncomfortable. And that usually, if you have something that's just going to be so direct on your skin, you want it to be comfortable. Because it's going to be touching your skin all day. That would suck. I like that it's flowy. I think you could wear it outside, like on a picnic date, or to the movies, to dinner. Very versatile, versatile dress. I got it from Goodwill, so that's also cool. It was a real snag. I think there's a word for finding cool things at Goodwill, but I don't know what it is. Anyways, I got another dress when I got this one, but it kind of has old lady vibes. And this one has cute vibes. So we like this one more. I would definitely wear it out, because even though I'm not a dress person, I do like this dress. I like it a lot. So I would wear it. So it definitely gets a two thumbs up for me. Yeah. What do you think? Yay, nay. Okay, well, on to the next one. Boom! Okay, now I know what you're probably thinking. Gray! Maybe you're not thinking that, but that's... Every time I do these try on videos, that's what I think about. And I still end up buying gray stuff. I do... I plan on doing two gray dresses. This one I have. If I do have another dress, I'm probably going to end up replacing it with, because... One is one gray dress is enough to so this one. I think it's fun. It um, has a little, a little hood. Ta da! <laughs> I don't know. It kind of feels weird, you know, a dress up a hood. Because hood, you know, is usually when it's like raining or weather is happening, but then you're wearing a dress. If crazy weather's happening, you're probably not gonna wear a dress but I kind of like hoods sometimes. They provide a feeling of security. I also, this may not be a spring dress in people's minds, but for me, uh, I probably would wear this during springtime. I probably would wear this in summertime too because I'm crazy, but I get really chilly, so the sleeves, oh, there's a thread, the sleeves, would be really nice so I don't get cold. But then I also have the cuteness of a dress. I like the stripe on the sleeves. It just has cute little things to give it that oop, because it is just gray. Bodycon, I think, is the word for it. They're really tight dresses. Correct me if I'm wrong. I'll probably Google it and correct myself if I'm wrong. But it gives it that little something to make it just a little bit more special. The stripes. It's like those shorts I've tried on before that have stripes on them from the side. It's like that, but for my body. Because it's a dress. It has a good length. Not too short. Not too long, though. I never want my skirts or dresses to be too long. This is another one. 
I would definitely wear out, despite the fact that I'm a non-dress person. I like this one. Feels very me, probably because it has long sleeves and a hood, and it's gray. It's basically a sweater, but dress. And I like that. <laughs> so, it's comfy, cozy vibes. So we're gonna move on to the next one, from this comfy, cozy dress, onto something else. Alrighty. Rather underwhelming. It has nightgown energy. Like I feel like I'm wearing pajamas. I mean, there's nothing wrong with that. Maybe I could wear this out and about. I'd be afraid because it's white and knowing me I would get something like barbecue sauce on it. Because for some reason I never eat something I always just get a little bit in the corner of my mouth. So I probably would end up getting it on this dress and then it would be ruined forever from one time, from one picnic. I definitely think I could wear this to a picnic though, don't you think? I like the white because it is cute. Wouldn't last long. I like it. I like the color. Also feels very springtime. This reminds me of flowers. White flowers. Still flowers. And it has the ribbed texture. So it's soft. It's it's just a dress. It's a white dress. There's not much to it. I feel like I'm trying to upsell it. And it's cool. I could probably go out in this. It's comfy. Probably bring a little sweater just in case. Avoid water because it's white. That wouldn't be fun. What do you think though? You like the simplicity of it? I, I like the simplicity of it. I know simplicity is not for everyone. I feel like everything I own though is pretty simple. <laughs> That's just me, I guess. So this would work for my purposes. Probably wouldn't be my first choice. Definitely wouldn't be my first choice. I think the last one, the gray one with the hood, would be my first choice so far. On to the next one. You may have seen this one before. It may look familiar. I've had it for a while now, actually. Oh, like quite a while. Ugh, it has those little hanger straps so it doesn't slip off. I usually cut them off, <laughs> but that's still there. Anyways, this is pretty sure it's my favorite dress that I own. It's one I've actually worn out in public before. Um, because again, I'm not a dress person. I like the color, the foresty green. Maybe more like a camo kind of green, military green. Green, it's green. <laughs> and I like that it's tight, the bodycon dress. Definitely the one I go for more, just because flowy. I like, I like it being, I like being snug, feeling secure. It's soft, doesn't irritate my skin by being on it at all. The length. The only thing is these straps are so tiny. Every time I put it on, I'm worried they're gonna snap. It probably would stay up pretty well, being a strapless dress. I don't think the straps are providing that much support, given how tiny they are. Definitely a good dress. Very springtime. I could wear it with like some Converse or Vans or something. I'm wearing socks. I always wear socks when my feet get cold. Like I said, I'm a very chilly person. <laughs> Which is also probably why dresses and I don't go together as much. I think they are cute though. I feel cute, depending on the dress. Like this one I feel cute in. The next one I also like how I look in. I've liked how I looked in the past ones too. What do you think? Do you like how I look in it? Is it good? I recommend this dress. Got it from Garage a while ago though, so. And I've had it for a while, because I like it. <laughs> I was very surprised when I tried it on. So well done, I feel cute. All right, we're gonna move on to the final dress of the evening. 
And last, but certainly not the least, we have a little red dress. And this one's definitely in the contender for my favorite. It's hard to tell if it's the red or the green one. I mean, this one is also pretty good, right? It's also soft. I got it off Amazon, so it was pretty cheap. So it's also a plus. I love the deep red color. It's a good red. Almost maroon, maybe? I might call it maroon, but it does look more red on the camera. I don't know. I don't know. You see it. This is what it looks like. It's soft. I like the tank top portion. I like this a tank top dress. Better than those tiny little straps on the green one. I would wear this out for sure. Could also be like a date night dress. Also feels pretty springtime, but it feels more sultry in a way because the red. So probably more leaning on a date is where I'd wear this. Something like that, or just out at the club dancing. Those kinds of things. Maybe a nice dinner. Oh yes, I'll have the salmon cake. Yeah, that's what I look like when I go to dinner. <laughs> it's a good dress. Do you like it? I like it. Two thumbs up. It's a good rating system. If I had more thumbs, that'd be even cooler. Cause then I could, but if I had like five thumbs, do one out of five thumbs, I'd be like, it's a four thumbs up. Instead, just two. Well, I hope you liked this try on haul. I'm working on doing more. It's been busy. I'm also gonna be moving soon. So there's that too. Make sure you like, comment, subscribe, turn on the notifications, all that good stuff. I'm watching. Do it. <laughs> also, there will be a behind the scenes video at mygbigbigirl.com. So if you wanna see that, go there. Good stuff, good behind the scenes. And with that, you go. I've been your host, Jay, for these dresses that you could wear during the springtime or anytime. No one's stopping you. Wear a dress. Do it whenever you want, wherever you want. <laughs> and I'll see you next time for the next video I do. Who knows what it's going to be. I'm going to be doing an Elden Ring type video. I don't know if it's going to be a review or just my I guess thoughts and opinions would also be kind of a review. But if you've been playing Elden Ring and you like watching me do anything video game related, then uh, then you'll really love that video. <laughs> Anyways, I'm gonna go. I'm talking on a tangent about a video that's not even this. Anyways, okay, bye. Have fun. See ya.